Hi guys, it is me. <laughs> I'm sometimes I'm weird. Hey guys, it's Monica. I am going to probably share with you a couple of empties only because I need to get rid of them. I'm running out of room. I I don't like having a whole lot of empties. So I'm going to share with you a couple of empties and a couple of products that I've been using and uh, maybe talk a little bit about our own vacation that we just had. <laughs> so if you're interested, stay tuned. Thank you so much for joining me. So I have been um, gathering up empties and I don't normally do that because it drives me batty, you know, to have all that stuff hanging around. I have a small house, so uh, it's, it's a little bit harder to um, collect things in a small house because it just is nutty. But I do have some empties that I'm going to share with you and some of these things I've used forever, so I'm not going to really go into... A whole bunch of details but first of all I've got a lot of hair products that are empty and um, one is my color cool violet both my shampoo and my moisturizer conditioner I've had these for well over a year I buy these you can get them from Amazon um, I usually buy them for my hairdresser this is the violet now because my bio hair tends to go brassy, I have to use a product like this. So I love this. This is the All Nutrient Color Violet. I probably normally, when I wash my hair, I probably use this once every two weeks when I wash my hair, and that's probably why it lasts as long as it does. But I love this. I already have my replacements for both the conditioner, moisturizing conditioner, and the shampoo. If you are a blonde, and in my, you know, in my house, I have hard water, and um, it, my the water will my hair will tend to be more brassy. So that really saves me big time. The other thing I <laughs> ran out of, which I've already replaced, cheap, cheap hairspray. <laughs> I love the sob. Sob, sob, sob. I get this in Walmart. You can get this anywhere. In grocery stores, anywhere. I get the Max Hold. This is the number eight. I have been using this for eons. Yes, I do try all sorts of different hairsprays, especially when they're sent to me from Octoly. But when, I, when I'm going out there and I'm buying it, it's this. I do use it a lot. It drives my hairdresser crazy because she can feel the buildup in my hair. But I still use this a lot, and I love this stuff, and I have my replacement. The other thing that I have three empties of is the um, Big Sexy Powder Play. I have two of the Big Sexy Powder Plays. I have another one that I have already. Um, one of these was in the motorhome, one was in the house. So when I ran out of the one in the house, I took the one from the motorhome, and there was very little bit left. I love the Powder Play. What I do, especially in the summertime when you're wearing hats or, you know, anything like that, you put the powder play on and you push it in, you know, mush, you know, sprinkle it on very lightly and then you, in, in dry hair or styled hair or second day hair or whatever, and you mush it around and it is amazing. It can make your flat hat hair look good. When I used to run at, or walk at work, um, I used to wear a baseball cap, and when I came back in, my hair, my hair was flat and saturated, and I still had to work. I would take some of this. I was headed in my bag. I'd sprinkle it in, and I would just through it, wish it through my hair, shoot, and my hair would puff up and look pretty good. So, big sexy hair, powder play, love this stuff, have a replacement, have been using it for a long, long time. I also have a um, sexy powder play, big sexy hair. This is just a different color, and I don't know why, but it is the exact same thing. So I've got three of them, actually, that I finally ran out of. Imagine that, having kept them all this time. And my e.l.f., oh my gosh, 
I, you know what? I love the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. I have a basket of primers that I've been using and trying. And some of them are really expensive primers, but I go back to this one. I love it. It's empty. I have a replacement. Actually, I think I have my replacement right here. I do. So uh, I love this stuff. I will continue to use this stuff. I got my replacement. I don't know why I'm smelling it. There is no smell. But I love this primer. It is, it is, I put it on my nose, basically, where my pores are big. And um, some of you are going to zoom in <laughs> where my pores are big. And just, I just put it on my nose. It really works. It works awesome. I've talked about this a couple of videos ago because I was getting ready for the wedding. I wanted my feet to look pretty. I have a pair of shoes. I'm going to superimpose the video here so you can see my toes and my, my, uh, in my shoes. Anyways, I had winter feet, dry, callous, icky. So I use the, this is the, uh, I've got this linked in my Amazon store. I think I'm going to try a different brand next time. I think I might have mentioned that. It comes to a pack. And I did this, but I didn't feel like I got a really huge peel like I did the first time. But, so I'll probably do another one. I love that. I also ran out of my topics. I use this to fill in when you're when you have thinning hair a um, something like this if you sprinkle it on really can make your hair look thick. Now I'm wearing a wig so you're not going to be able to tell but I ran out of this. Uh, have no fear. Have no fear. <laughs> I ran out of this but I have a whole new one. A whole big one. It's pricey but I really really like it. The other thing that I used, and I really like this, this is the Emma Hardy, and this is their Morinigna, M-O-R-I-N-G-A Cleansing Balm. I don't know where I got this. I don't know if it was sent to me. In, I don't think it was sent to me in PR, but I think I might have gotten it in a boxy charm or in something. It could even have been... Oh gosh, I don't know. You know, could have been anything really, but bone dry, empty. I love this cleanser. It is so nice. It's a cleansing balm. Made my skin feel really nice. Love it. Not going to rebuy it though because I have a lot of cleansers and I'm currently working my way through Peach's Skin Care Cleanser. I really like that a lot. Setting spray. Finally finished this. This is the Bella Jade Marlene Fab and Glam Turn Beyond to This. I love this. I am buying another one, um, but not until I finish the two setting sprays that I have. I love this. Perfect setting spray. This is the Sky High Mascara. Finished it up. Love it. I have a backup already, which I will be finishing. I also use my my, this is the Essence in purple. So between these two mascaras, these are my mascaras of choice. When I went away for the wedding, this is the mascara I brought with me and the mascara I used the entire time at the wedding. Really like it a lot. Blink, I think I've gone through a couple of empties on this. I'm going to do an announcement on a winner for Blink. Um, and I think I'm gonna draw that in my next video. A couple of masks. I took these with me, the Hydro Masks from City Beauty. I took uh, four of them, five of them with me on vacation. Oh my gosh, I love these masks. They make me feel so good. I also have a Gin Amber mask. Love them. And then Dr. Jart. These are the masks that I just have a lot of, but it is the City Beauty one that I've really used the most of. And then the little makeup removers. I get this at... Sam's Club. Members mark, and I think that is Sam's Club exclusive brand, I think. So I get these at Sam's Club. I really like them a lot. And um, I probably definitely have, probably have another big box of them because I buy them at Sam's Club in a big box. On Point Liquid Eyeliner. I've had this forever, On Point Liquid Eyeliner. This is by Pure P-U-R. Um, I like it a lot, but I've got a ton of different eyeliners that I'm going to use, so I'm not going to, you know, not going to rebuy that. 
I don't even remember when I got it or, or anything of that nature. While I was away, I brought my Boots Number no. 7 foundation with me with the sunblock. And the rest of the time, I did my Estee Lauder. So I had my Estee Lauder. This is what I wore at the wedding. I really, really liked it. I also brought with me, I didn't mention this product beforehand, but this is from City Beauty, brand new to me. I'll link all the information, but this is an ultra firming dry oil. I love it. <laughs> I haven't used it all that long. I took it with me on vacation and um, I used it twice a day. What you do, it's a dry oil. You apply it to your clean. I can never say that word. Decolletage, 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 decolletage in your neck and you go in an upward motion and you just massage it in. I, I don't know that it's making my neck look better yet but I love the way it makes my skin feel when I put it on. So I put it on my chest, I bring it up, I go up my neck, and I'm just kind of massaging it in. I just really, I think this is ultra dry firming dry oil. I am going to list all the ingredients. I think this is a fantastic product. This was sent to me complimentary from City Beauty. I am an affiliate member of City Beauty. I know a lot of other influencers are as well. And I just missed their lipstick sale because I was away. And I do have some City Beauty lipsticks or glosses that I really like. But I miss that, this product, a lot, a lot. That's my empties. Um, we had a great time when we were away. The weather was cooler. On our last day, we went uh, from Hilton Head. We drove back to Savannah. We went to Tybee Island. Jay and I went around, walked around Tybee Island, and we did we did really good. Then we wanted to go back to the riverfront area and walk around there, but we couldn't find parking. So we ended up going back to the airport a little bit early, which was fine, and we got settled in. The Savannah Airport is uh, beautiful. I couldn't I couldn't believe it. So it was a mixed bag, COVID-wise. I saw people, you know, without masks, people with masks. Now in the airport, in the planes, everyone had their masks on. Everybody was social distancing. It was pretty good. Um, but out and about, Hilton Head Island mandated mask wearing, so you had to wear a mask all the time. But um, other than that, some people were without masks. Some people had masks on. I felt totally, totally fine the entire time. We had our hand sanitizer. We had our mask. We bought, uh, what do they call the K95 or whatever off of Amazon. Uh, we bought we, in black, right, so that it would blend in, not look like, you know, stick out. So we had that. And then for the wedding itself, I had a really pretty fancy mask, and I it was silver with like glitters and I just put it over the black one and it looked fine it really did and I was totally protected so that was really awesome I did good on my my tr attempt to <laughs> weight loss yeah right attempt I did really good um, I've been trying to do intermittent fasting and I've been taking the apple cider vinegar gummies that I had shown you I think in a previous video I'll link them below but I've been taking those and I think between the intermittent fasting and the apple cider gum gummies, I think that it's helping me with my appetite a little bit and also giving me a little bit of boost of energy. So we were on vacation. We Every time we went out to dinner, I had a drink. And I had the type of drinks that you have on vacation. Frou-frou, girly drinks, high calorie, sugar, syrup, strawberry daiquiris, pina coladas, um, melon colada, really good tasting drinks. So I had a at least a drink. I don't think I had more than one. I didn't, I didn't have more than one, except maybe at the wedding, but that was Diet Coke and rum. So, but on vacation, I had, every time we went out to dinner, I had a drink and it was high calorie frou-frous. And I came back from vacation, I didn't feel like I gained anything. In fact, I thought I might've lost something. And I think it's the apple cider vinegar and um, the intermittent fasting. So I keep your fingers crossed for me. I'm trying to low carb. Uh, I'm just trying to be super good. I do have to place an order of my built bars. I'm all out of built bars and those things really help hold my appetite big time. So I'm gonna place an order for that. But um, 
And we just had a great time at the wedding. And even though the weather was colder than I expected, it was nice to get away. It was nice to feel somewhat almost normal. Somewhat. Somewhat. Not completely, but somewhat. So anyways, um, yeah, that's the scoop. Oh, and on my head, I have Raquel Welch. Real Edge. No, Real Teal. I don't know why I said Real Edge. Or maybe it is Real Edge. Mm -hmm. I'll have to look it up. Um, I had that on my head. I love this wig. I just think this wig is so... I love the color. It's just so... It's so pretty. I'll do a quick turn. So you can see what it looks like at all angles. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys, for watching. I will catch you in my next video. Stay safe. Stay happy. And I'll see you later.